Example 2.3. In this example, we have a mountain lake which has an average temperature of 10 Celsius and has a maximum depth of 20 meters. The barometric pressure at that location is 598 millimeters of mercury. We need to determine the absolute pressure at the deepest part of the lake. If we want to calculate the pressure at any point inside of the lake, we're going to have the relationship P at any location is going to be the gamma of water, since that's the fluid inside of the lake, times the elevation at which you would like to find the pressure, plus the atmospheric pressure. The atmospheric pressure in this problem is given in terms of millimeters of mercury, so we would like to transfer it into pascals so that we could use in the calculation. So P0 is going to be simply the gamma of mercury times the elevation that it was given. So P0 is going to be 133 kilonewtons divided by meter cube times the elevation that it was given, which is 0.598 meters. If we do this calculation, the atmospheric pressure becomes 79.5 kilonewtons per meter square or kilopascals. Okay, so what we need to calculate now are the values of the gamma of water at that particular temperature. So we go to the back of the book and we look that at 10 Celsius, the value of the gamma of water is given to be 9.804 kilonewtons per meter cube. So now let's calculate the pressure um, at the bottom of the lake, which is at 40 um, meters. So we're going to have the P is going to be equal to 9.04 kilonewtons meter cube times the depth, which is 40 meters, plus 79.5 kilonewtons per meter square. Please note, always double check whether if you have kilonewtons in both quantities, then you could add them. If you didn't have kilonewtons, you have to properly convert into newtons or pascals to be able to add the two quantities together. The, after you do the calculations, the pressure at the bottom should give you 472 kilopascals. Please go back and double check the calculations and make sure that you are able to do the conversion between uh, millimeters of mercury into pascals and be able to get the same results that we got here.